Another fight. <laughs> hey, fight! Oh, just called out the start time. Sure. They're trying to use a Patrick against us. They are. Yeah, I know that it says boss chef, but the text is wrong. That's a Patrick. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna make it rain. So, um. Thank you. <laughs> dollar dollar bills, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so they're they're. Uh, uh, the Pokemon company, uh, or the, the company that does the animation for them. Mm -hmm. Animation studio. That's the word I was looking for. <laughs> uh, the phrase I was looking for. Friggin' confused, the son of a... Ugh. Ugh. I, I friggin' hate you. I, I think you're... you're, you're I'm dead now. Yeah. Um, anyways, the, the animation studio for the Pokemon is... Their next movie is redoing the Indi Indigo League huh. arc as a movie. Wow. Um, so, the the Pokemon that everyone was introduced to with, you know, Ash and Pikachu and Brock and Misty, mm -hmm. 76 episode season, quote unquote, yeah. is being condensed down into like a two and a half hour movie. That is going to be terrible. Well, here's, that, that's not actually the part that's going to make it terrible. Oh, God. They have on their website listed all the all the the main characters along with their voice actors. Guess who is uh, guess who's missing? Guess who is getting written out of the arc? Who? Brock and Misty. What? Yeah. How are they? Yeah. <laughs> Even if they don't come along as companions, they're gym leaders. You can't write them out of the arc. What the actual hell? I. I don't know. Like we haven't seen what what they're doing with that. We know that the the super sad butterfree um, mm -hmm. scene is still in there. Like because it was here's our here's our animation teaser. Yeah, it's still in there. They completely redid that scene. No Brock and Misty in it. Brock and Misty weren't in that scene for the most part. They were at least in back. They were in background shot. Like it's the whole scene is what they show. Gotcha. And Brock and Missy were in parts of it because remember they they sort of sort of gave uh, Ash like. Um, oh, we haven't caught this thing. Yet. I know. That's why I've okay. been weakening it. Sorry, I thought we were finding a trainer. Um, Brock and Missy were giving Ash, you know, supporting yeah. phrases. So like, okay, you got to let the butterfree go and stuff like that. They're not there. Just, huh. They're not. Uh, uh, yeah, and guys, we're, we're not naming Pokemon today, just we, we don't have the... Lazy. We, we, we have the lazy. <laughs> we very much have the lazy today. Um, although, uh... I think I would have called that thing uh, Cottonelle. <laughs> or, oh god, what? Or, no, Q-Tip. Okay. Po yeah, pro probably Q-Tip, spelled uh, uh, C-U-T-I-P. <laughs> Just uh Don't don't be rustling my herd. <laughs> Farmer Slim. Oh, Slim and his Mareep. Um I, I don't understand how they're going to do Indigo League without Brock and Misty. Especially because Brock and Misty were such popular characters mm -hmm. that they show up in more than just Indigo League. Yeah. Didn't uh, didn't they follow him for like a couple Misty's, Misty at least followed Misty him. stuck with him through the Indigo League, the Orange Islands, and I believe she stuck around for the Johto League as well. And then she showed up in a couple other seasons as like cameos. Yeah. Uh, but and then Brock had a similar. Brock, did, Brock only followed around for the Indigo League, I think. And then he, he was replaced by the cameraman. Yes, for the Orange from, Islands, he was replaced with uh, the guy from Pokemon Snap. Yeah, uh, I'm forgetting his name. But, um, but then he also had the thing of, hey, I'm a gym leader, so therefore there's a reason for me to go around and visit other gyms and show up as cameos. Yeah. In stuff. So it's like, they're not. So the fact that they're not having either of them in there as main characters is sort of super mind-boggling when they're in, 
the t uh, like the top five most popular Pokemon characters. And we're not counting Pokemon because yeah. Pikachu wins by a goddamn landslide. Like it, you don't put Pikachu on the goddamn pole anymore. You, yeah, you start at spot two and work down. Pikachu is number one, and then but yeah. you have Ash. Brock, Misty, Jesse, and James. They're the top five. They <laughs> switch around based on who you're asking, but they are in the top five. Yeah. So, to not include them, you're cutting 40, at least 40% of your recognizable faces. Yeah. And I don't remember if Jesse and James are kind of in it either. Like, uh... you can do the Indigo League arc without Team Rocket. It's not as good. Oh, we didn't want to prevent that. Oh, that's right. We were saving her. We have to. Uh, we have to remove Bubble Beam. Like she needs to have Bubble Beam re be replaced to prevent that evolving. I'm not replacing Bubble Beam until she gets a better water attack. Uh, yeah, though. I know, but it's it's. We'll no, have to deal with that every time. So, I'm gonna do that. Do if that over there. You get the lucky egg. Oh, wait, what are our po oh, oh, can can we cut that? Probably not. They took out the ability to cut grass after uh, Gen 2, I believe. Okay. This place is so boring. There was a Pokeball behind that tree. That's yep. Oh! Ah, Bach. Hey, look, it's a Cobra. I mean, an Arbok. <laughs> <laughs> uh... Yeah, for any anyone that tries and clips, oh yeah, they had bad naming ideas after Gen 1. It's like, come on. Gen 1, you had Cobra spelled backwards, and you had Snake spelled backwards, and you had a freaking Pokeball was a Pokemon. Yeah. It was just turned upside down. So they've had dumb ideas from the start. Yes. Although I do miss Chubby Pikachu. Like, yeah. Gen 1 Chubby Pikachu was the best. Pikachu was awesome. It's it's also sad that punch you that like just the programming size limit you had on those cartridges prevent uh, prevented a whole bunch of nifty. Uh, that's the bigger cat thing, I think. Bigger cat thing uh, from the normal type jam. I don't remember it. Well, I almost we'll we'll see it in just a second. Oh no! Oh no! Okay, oh yeah. no! That's that's the uh, the ugly ugly totes adorbs. <laughs> it's not quite as adorable adorbs. Yep. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go with. Fuck, what a, uh, it was a bad. I place. was ranting. Uh, let's see. I was ranting about the animation studio, and then what was I saying after that? Um, fuck. I got I got distracted. By I don't remember. I'm gonna stop now it. you see that's gonna bug me now. Like it really <laughs> is. It's gonna. Jesse James. Talking about doing the league with Poke Chubs. Yes. Right. That and, okay, Poke Chubs and then the cartridge size limits preventing oh by Patrick. Preventing uh, nifty things like uh, the Kubone and the Kangas Khan uh, connection. Yeah, that was That's entirely, entirely a fans, theory. A, a theory, but it like it fits so well that it was just sort of a we can never confirm. We can neither confirm nor deny that this is the case of what it is. Heck. I, I still love that little snake arm coming out of diabetes. Yeah. Like, <laughs> 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 I didn't see who. The yeah, because you're. you're uh, oh, okay. oh, it's a kinetic Bad. Yeah. <laughs> Die, Milvac. <laughs> oh, he's gonna spark you. Sparky, Sparky, boom, man. Uh, of course, I'm friggin' paralyzed. Of course, why wouldn't you be paralyzed? Oh, but now you're gonna be double paralyzed. Double, triple paralyzed. Secret probation. Oh. <laughs> Man, I you see that's a movie I need to watch again. Which movie? Oh, uh, uh, Animal House. Never actually seen it. it. But I I've gotten to the point, Chris, where <laughs> if I name a movie, I'm I'm almost like expecting you 
to say that phrase. Yeah. Like, even if it's a movie I know you've seen, I'm, it's like, I kind of half expect you to say it anyways. It's like, oh yeah, I've never seen that movie. It's like, we watched it last night. For lunch. That's, That's the, the big cat. cat. Okay. Uh, uh, I'm gonna throw yeah, in Tex Bane. Me. Oh, I would have actually thrown Spony there and then immediately switched Spony out, because Spony could use the XP a little bit. Like, eh. I know. Sp- if, we're, Sp- if we're specifically waiting to evolve it, I'm not going to bother. Well, in that case, we really should, the next time we get to town, switch yeah. out Spony. Yeah. Um, it's just, we, we needed Spony for a specific, whatever. Spony's been with us for so long, it's kind of like, Spony, we need you here. You're our team mascot, even though you're not. Yep. Oh... Okay. Remind me on the next episode to uh, talk about Disney and the Emperor. Disney and the Emperor. Okay. Not, not, not the Emperor's new groove. The Emperor. The Emperor. The Emperor. Oh, the Emperor. Yes. Remind me to talk about that. Just because there's not enough time left in this episode to get through the topic. Gotcha. Um, but uh, just that's that's so disturbing. So what is so cotton balls, mm-hmm. right? Yeah. What is the? We call them cotton balls. They haven't succumbed to the Kleenex or Xerox syndrome yet. Mm-hmm. But what is a freaking name brand of cotton balls? I don't know. I don't I know. know. Q- because a Q-tip is just a cotton ball on the end of a toothpick. Exactly. Is what it is. And, like, the companies that make... Because Q-tip is a company, isn't it? Like Yes, Q-tip, Q-tip is a Q-tip company. Is company. And Q-tip makes cotton balls. But there's no... Because... And that's the, that's the other thing. A Q-tip is also falls into the Xerox and the uh, yeah and the Kleenex syndrome of oh, get, pass me a Q-tip when it's it's a cotton ball on a stick is what it is. Then you can get non-Q-tip brand versions of it. Yeah, kind of and Band Aid as well. Um, but what 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 freaking other companies make like cotton balls? I haven't even. We can't slightest. control him yet. Like, because we, we haven't figured out how to, to heal him yet. That's why he's in here. Uh, do, 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 do. So... I could go with you. You're just another Spony. Well, actually, let's go with... Why do we have three Spony. Let's oh, go with okay. not our Spony and let it evolve. Yeah, we can do that. So that we can see its bigger version. Normal flying. Do, do. Yeah, it's just plain. Yeah, see, it's, it's so generic. And so we got what's our the next pony up or that one's level thirteen. Oh, it's, uh, Pangarang, what the hell was I thinking? God, Pargon, 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 Pargon. It's it's so it's so amusing to come back into these and just see what were we thinking? <laughs> Actually, um, we don't have a grass type right now. We've got. Electric uh, ground. We've got electric to deal with pretty much the same thing I, that grass I, can. I know, but what I'm saying is, why don't we switch out and take the uh, the water the water grass guy? Water grass. Uh, oh, low yeah, tide. Yeah, let's just take the low tide. Eh, low you, t- you don't want to have an actual po- an actual Pokemon, or uh, is, C- is Cecil an actual Pokemon? Yes. Oh, that's sad. I'm gonna just go with okay the other Spony. We gotta find the po- we we need to find the Pokemon renamer so that we can name our po- our Spony <laughs> into something else so that they actually remember when we replace the Spony. Yep. Because right now, uh, because because we do a crossfade effect to to show when we're changing our Pokemon or when they're um, I'm giving you behind the scenes stuff. We do a crossfade <laughs> between the two. What? Is that an actual Pokemon? Or is yes, that it's an actual one. It's a ghost type. Interesting looking. It is. Um, but we do a crossfade effect. So that switch right there mm-hmm. that we just did between the two the two Spawnies, you're crossfading from the same image to the same image, and it's not going to change. Like, you won't even notice that I've done the crossfade. <laughs> Which means I'm not actually going to do the crossfade. But... Um, <laughs> What the? That was interesting. It's not very powerful, but it can flinch. Oh, that, that's actually really useful. It, just the reuse last item thing? Yeah. Can you put it to sleep, or is it... I can it. I can put it to sleep now that I think about it. Although, Dude. Diabetes is confused. Okay. Woo! 
Alright, cool. Keep your ass asleep. It's fast asleep. But is, is that just a reused last item thing down there? Yeah. Or? Okay. Uh, All right, I hate you, and it's gonna wake up. Oh, holy cow! I think it's I think it's programmed to just wake up if you hit it. So this I can't really tell what it's supposed to be, like just from the it's a floating head, essentially. Oh uh, well. It, Okay, yeah, that makes more sense. Frightens people with creepy sobbing cry. Apparently uses its red spheres to absorb the fear of foes. Is... Okay. Well, you don't get a nickname either. <laughs> I don't even know what I mean, but you just terrify me. All right, folks, we'll see you next time. Um, bye.